Patty Bender. I have two things I'd like to talk about, so I'll try and make my first comments be brief, which are about the name change. I disagree with a large portion of the people here, uh, and I think that this should be decided by the people that live here and not by people from outside. So however we choose to do that, I really agree with a lot with what Nick has said before, and the woman sitting next to him, I can't remember her name, but again, I really believe, I don't believe that it should be changed for various reasons. I believe we teach inclusion and equity, and I, I don't believe the name is something we need to focus on. But the other thing I'd like to talk about is what is going on. I keep hearing by one particular board member the word transparency. I hear it over and over again out of this board member's mouth. And then what we see on Facebook and then on the news is them representing themselves as a Dixie School Board member and saying, and it looks like to the public, that this is the entire Dixie School, that she's speaking for the Dixie School District, and she's not. Marnie Glickman, you talk about transparency over and over again. But since July, you have been on your Facebook, you've been on Twitter, you've been stirring the pot, getting all these people together, and then you went on the news on Friday night with the word Dixie School Board under your name. You are, you are elected by your constituents to represent them. And I'm pretty sure what I've been hearing in the community is you're not representing all of them. an ally against racism? Excuse me, you're not supposed to speak. I respected you. I didn't speak up when anybody else was speaking. So I expect the same respect. So if you choose to have your name out there, do not put it with the Dixie School District. It is not, that's not why you were put in office. And I know a lot of people would like to see you removed from office right now. Thank you. Yes.